Hello viewers you're watching Public TV English we are bringing you the major updates of today Suspended JDS MP Prajwal Revanna was on Friday arrested at Bengaluru airport and brought to the CID office in Bengaluru after he landed at Kempegowda International Airport He returned to India from Germany nearly a month after leaving the country on a diplomatic passport and was immediately taken into custody Prajwal was taken to the Bowring and Lady Curzon Hospital in Bengaluru for medical examination He was later taken to the city civil court complex and produced before the 42nd ACMM court judge. Prajwal Revanna faces allegations of sexual harassment and criminal intimidation. The Karnataka government set up an SIT following a complaint by a woman who worked in his household. State Home Minister G Parameshwara said on Friday that the authorities will do what is legally required and said Prajwal seemed to be cooperating with the authorities. PM Modi is in Kanyakumari on a spiritual visit. The PM Modi arrived at the Vivekananda Rock Memorial on Thursday. The PM is meditating at the Dhyan Mantapam, the place where revered Hindu philosopher Swami Vivekananda is believed to have had a divine vision about Bharat Mata. The PM will continue his meditation till June 1st. He is sending a signal of national unity by going to Kanyakumari. PM Modi offered prayers at Bhagavati Amman Temple in Kanyakumari on Thursday before heading to the Vivekananda Rock Memorial. As the deadline to surrender nears, Delhi CM Arvind Kejriwal on Friday posted an emotional message and said that he is proud that he is going to jail to save the country from dictatorship. Kejriwal had got interim bail from the Supreme Court on May 10th and was asked to surrender to Tihar jail on June 2nd. In his video message Kejriwal said that his spirits are high and that they tried to make him bow down but he didn't. He also claimed that while in jail his insulin injections had been denied for many days and that his blood sugar level had shot up. He also urged people to pray for his ailing parents. Mangaluru is witnessing a spectacle of surfing prowess as the 5th edition of the Indian Open of Surfing IOS, the nation's premier surfing competition kicked off on Friday. The event brings together the country's top-ranked surfers at the iconic Sasi Hitlu beach to showcase their skills in the 3-day championship. Some of the top names will be seen in action including the likes of Srikant D, Surya P, Ajish Ali, Shivraj Babu, Surya P, Kamali Murthy, Ishita Malviya, Srishti Selvam. The Karnataka government has extended its support to the event for the 5th consecutive year. The event has received major support from the new Mangalore Port Authority. Bruhat Soma, a 7th grader of Indian origin, claimed the US National Spelling Bee Championship title along with the Scripps Cup trophy and a check for $50,000 after correctly spelling a 90-second spell-off against the second runner-up, 12-year-old Faizan Zaki from Texas. 12-year-old Bruhat spelled 29 words correctly in the tiebreaker, beating Zaki by 9 to win the title on Thursday night. His winning word was abseil which means a descent in mountaineering by means of a rope looped over a projection above. The Scripps National Spelling Bee attracted 11 million contestants from around the world and Soma emerged as one of the most confident finalists. He is the 28th Indian American to have held the title. The 12-year-old beat 228 other competitors including seven finalists on Thursday night.